There you go, perfect. Students at Bruce Randolph School, Kip Denver Collegiate High School, Martin Luther King Jr. Early College, and Manuel High School are getting a hands-on education in the culinary arts. See how it's thickened? Mm -hmm. It's not ready yet. But it's not your typical cooking class. Eat Well at School is a nine-week after-school program developed by Live Well Colorado, focused on giving the teens the skills and knowledge essential to healthy eating habits. If you allow them to work in the process of creating the food, they're more um, accepting into eating the, and the food, even if it's something that they completely hate. And so the biggest thing for us was trying to get healthy ingredients into dishes that you wouldn't normally think of healthy. Like today, we did the zucchini muffins. It tastes really good. I ate three muffins. <laughs> Under the guidance of volunteer chef mentors from Johnson & Wales University, the students learn how to handle knives. It's a good dice, Marcos. And read nutrition labels. Grab it and check the bag to see if it's actually healthy. Well, they're also learning a little bit about sanitation, so they're you know, not killing people when they're making a chicken. All the while gaining confidence and familiarity with healthy foods. You got broccoli and you're like, what do I do with broccoli? Um, where these guys learned how to, you know, dice it and chop it and saute it and eat it raw. We made black bean brownies and I hate black beans and I actually ate it. By preparing and tasting nutritious meals. So we made a steak salad. We're making a panini wrap. These teens are building a foundation for healthy habits that they can rely on in the future. It's like helped me realize like I should start eating more healthy. It's not going to McDonald's and buying hot and spicy. <laughs> now I can go home and actually cook for my family and not just put something in the microwave. Yeah. They're pan searing steaks now. They're making a vinaigrette. Equipped with these new skills, each team was challenged to create a healthy school lunch menu that conforms to the budget and nutrition standards of public school lunches, including a main dish and side dish. Bean enchiladas with a vegetarian rice. And a healthy dessert. A fruit stuffed muffin in which we layer the bottom with a little bit of oranges and then stuff a peach right inside during the middle of baking. I would serve this at a restaurant and I would definitely serve that at a restaurant. And at the end of week nine, the teams faced off in a frantic 45-minute cook-off, preparing their school lunch menus for a panel of judges. And the winning team was, drum roll please, Bruce Randolph School with their healthy chicken wrap, their vinaigrette-based coleslaw, and jalapeno-infused peach crumble. The same menu you're enjoying today. Live Well Colorado would like to thank the following sponsors and partners. Without their support, the Eat Well at School program would not have been possible. The Ann Schutz Foundation, Denver Public Schools, Healthy Schools Campaign and the Cooking Up Change National Healthy Cooking Contest, Johnson & Wales University College of Culinary Arts, Anadarko Petroleum Corporation, Davida, Western Dairy Association, Comcast Spotlight, The Colorado Trust, KMGH-TV, and Chef Shelly Kark, Kitchen Cue.